I'm gonna start vlogmas here. So hello, welcome to episode one. I think I'm gonna figure out how I'm gonna do this. This is episode one of vlogmas 2019. Uh, I have I really intended on doing vlogmas I'm, I'm going like this I have a laptop here I'll get to that um I was intending on doing vlogmas for a long time I did it last year I did it for the most part last year and then uh things got very insane which I think was maybe the last like episode I posted uh I'll link it I think it's over here maybe it's over here I remember uh, I'll link it one of those places that was when I was just about to move to the US I thought for a year plus turns out it was only six months didn't have an internship got an internship the internship was in the city I wasn't gonna move to so you can catch up on last year's vlogmas that was a lot but I was also working a lot right now a uh, very different phase of life that I didn't expect I am currently doing my masters and it is final season Woo! So I don't have any exams, but I have uh, the woo sarcastic, obviously. I don't have any exams, but I have three papers, one of which is due tomorrow, and I'm about halfway done. I've been working on it for days now, and I just have the attention span of a hamster. So, as I said to, uh, I, I admitted to many people, I've never taken study drugs, but if somebody offered me them right now, I'd probably take them. I wouldn't, I wouldn't. I wouldn't but I will insert a clip from what I did yesterday happy vlogmas day one this is what I'm doing all day so which was nothing and then a clip from earlier today it's currently 2 30 p.m. I went to class I went to the library I don't have a clip from class but it was my final class of the semester but it's actually like not even class week now it was just like a we had to like make up a class and then went to the library actually got some work done on my essay got all the sources I needed downloaded and stuff like that because I wasn't able to access them at home and it was very stressful and now I left the library a little bit early because I'm going to go and volunteer now um I've said this before I'm helping out with the dance class for little kids with special needs and I got here early because I want to I want to post today because I usually upload on Mondays this is not going to be going up on Monday but hopefully this video goes up today uh, if I can get my shit together which I'm gonna to do now because I have about half an hour to like review this and get it going I have the thumbnail made which is good but I did this last week and it kind of worked I'm currently just sitting in my car the engines on right now but I'm gonna turn it off as soon as I stop recording um, and I'm just going to review the video that I'm gonna upload once I get home um, so then I can just set it to upload while I'm cooking my dinner and then go and do that and I have to go pick up my neighbor from somewhere else but we are very stressed uh, I think I'm gonna do vlogmas like every five days I feel like that might be a way to do it uh i'm just gonna organize it basically once i feel that's enough for a vlog we'll move on to the next one but these few days i i they just couldn't have their own vlogs that's really where this is starting from so i'm gonna get to trying to finish editing and reviewing this and then go have fun with little kids and then go home and be really stressed again I'm very stressed and i forgot i was vlogging so it's like almost 8 p.m. now. I'm working on my paper. I'm, I've said this before, I'm like halfway through, uh, like barely halfway through and it's a 4,000 word paper and it's due tomorrow. So like, I'm great. Um, I'm gonna pick up my neighbor in a little bit. Um, my face is super pink, don't know why. That's just life. I have a uh, Sky News on in the background and yeah, I'm just like on the struggle bus right now with this paper. I've written two out of five sections that I want to do. Um, and then obviously I have my introduction mostly written. Um, I'm just finding my own hair on myself. And then the conclusion, which I've allocated like 400 words for. So I really hope I can get to that. Uh, but we're just going to keep going uh will this be an all-nighter i don't know i don't think so but like maybe happy day three of vlogmas <laughs> it's december 3rd now we are getting there that's all i have to say
or struggling. Uh, I think I have all my 15 sources now. Like I'm like using the ones I haven't specifically referenced yet. And I'm on the final two. Like I'm on the second last big paragraph. And then I need to work on my introduction and conclusion. And then I'm going to review it tomorrow. I'm going to get it like I'm not leaving any of this to be like written tomorrow. Mm. Uh, but I'm going to go through it all tomorrow and submit it because it says that it needs to be submitted by 4.30 p.m. on the module outline, but then it says like 6 p.m. online, so I'm going to do it at 6 p.m. Or I'll try and do it before 4, but you know, if it happens. I just, you know when you need to remind yourself that, I was trying to say to my friend, she was like, it's only two weeks, it's only two weeks, it's only two weeks for some of the other submissions, and I was like, you need to think that in two weeks this will be over. That's how I have to think about this. That, you know, it seems impossible until it's done. And that's how I've pretty much done all of my assignments. So it is six minutes past midnight. Uh, I'd put money on me getting this completed tonight because I don't have another time and I'm not going to let it not get done. So I'm just kind of figuring out what I'm going to do because I'm home alone. I don't know whether I want to put the dog in her bed like she is closed into one of the rooms at night and I go upstairs or if I want to stay here a little bit I've just got Sky News running in the background but it's starting to bother me also I'm drinking Diet Coke for caffeine that's cool but I just can't wait for this to be over that's how I feel right now I look like a greasy mess it's like 4 a.m. and I'm not finished my paper but I'm gonna go to sleep and my eyes look like I'm on drugs um but I'm gonna, it's not due till 4 p.m. So I'm just gonna get up in the morning. And you have like 400 words I have to write. But I was honestly just like not with it. I don't know. I, I wrote, I was like writing bullet points, you know, to like what I was thinking of right now that I might want to cover. And I literally wrote, some countries are just hella unstable. And I was like, you know what? You gotta go to sleep. I'm also really hungry. But that's because it's like 4 a.m. I haven't eaten in like eight hours. Yeah, I just wanted to be morning except i wish i'd had sleep but you know you win some you lose some and we will get this paper submitted on time i feel like it's a really shit paper though which is kind of unfortunate but it do be like that sometimes the assignment has been submitted you know you feel like all this weight's gonna be lifted off you once you submit it but it's really not because i you're not gonna get your grade. I look like trash. So I'm going to try and tidy myself up, literally just enough to bring the dog for a walk. I also look super red because my walls are pink and I'm pink. Um, and then I'm gonna come home and just generally tidy. And we're actually going to get to do something other than write a paper. There's a lot of cleaning I want to do, some needle pointing I want to do. I need to do something in a planner. So it's gonna be nice and relaxing. I just remembered that I'm supposed to be semi-vlogging. Uh, so this is obviously like the third boring day, but I was able to get all the things around the house I needed to do and I'm currently working on some needlepoint and watching Brooklyn Nine-Nine because that's the best. Um, this is, I'm like posting a lot of it on Instagram because uh, I have my mom book blocked from my stories I think I might have my friend's mom blocked from my stories as well just because I've been posting progress on both my needlepoint projects but because of this one um it's going to be a birthday present for my mom or else a Christmas present I'm not sure her birthday is like four days before Christmas so I'm just yeah catching up on some Brooklyn Nine Nine. Nothing's really happening here. I'll show you a little clip of Sparkles being adorable. Um, but I had thought about going into college tomorrow, like emailing one of my lecturers to see if I could meet him to talk about my thesis, like as in potential thesis, uh, tomorrow, because like, but that was like I'm not in the mood. So I'll email tomorrow and see if we maybe we can meet Friday or. Thursday, I'm not sure. But yeah, I was just like, no, to Wednesday, we're just gonna have a day. And then Thursday, we're gonna get like back on the horse about the other two assignments. So one of them is to do with the thesis proposal. So yeah, me and Sparker is just chilling. I'll show you her, she's so cute.
I'm a real human today. I'm up a little while now, it's almost midday. Um, and I was just cleaning the bathroom. What a glamorous life. Uh, I'm also gonna just go downstairs and do some more of the needlepoint project I'm working on because as I said, my mom is not here at the minute and it's like the only time, sorry, I'm making my bed. It's the only time I'm able to like work on it downstairs and like without trying to hide it uh, is when she's not here. So uh, she's like, I know exactly where she is and she's in Dublin. So she will not be coming across me needle pointing her Christmas present. Um, so I'm gonna do that now and probably eat some lunch in a bit. And I really do need to start my other papers, but like, I'm not gonna do that. So I also need to email one of my lecturers, um, like who's the course director so that I can get an appointment to talk about my thesis proposal. So yeah, that is what's happening now. Today's Wednesday. So tomorrow we have like the staff student Christmas party, like for graduate students. So that should be interesting. I'm aware that my eyeshadow is very intense, but like, what's new? I was just like jamming, <laughs> putting on makeup. I was like, I'm actually not gonna go anywhere so we can go as dramatic as we wish. I just got a text from the Irish Blood Donation Clinic. I need to figure out if I'm able to donate because they always change the rules and it's so annoying. I think tomorrow for the Christmas party, so they say to you like, wear your most festive jumper, you know, like, tacky Christmas jumper and there's gonna be spot prizes. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. Uh, I do not like tacky Christmas jumpers or dresses or anything like that. Uh, I just think it is, like I have this, this is like a cute casual festive jumper and then I have this like sparkly one. So I think I'll wear this, you'll see it tomorrow. Um, I think I'm gonna wear this with a little skirt and you know, do a jazzy like hair accessory and whatever and look glam but not tacky. I think my mom's gonna be back soon so I am bringing my cross stitch upstairs uh, but because I was working on my paper for the last like three days straight I was like not on Instagram so much and I'm sorry it's kind of dark up here um because it's like 4 p 3 p.m it's gonna get dark soon um but I obviously like wasn't on Instagram or anything like that I wasn't paying attention to much like that and I was just like scrolling I was like oh let me just go on Instagram like just bopping around there it turns out like Danny Austin and Caitlin Covington who are two bloggers if you don't know who they are they're in Ireland they're like in Killarney they got here like a day or two ago and I'm just so confused I how did I miss this I mean like they're in freaking Stevens Green shopping center like taking pictures what the f anyways my eyes are watering. I am gonna call my mom, see where she is, and I'm gonna bring the dog out for a walk, I think, if she wants to go. My dog's very elderly, so sometimes she doesn't wanna go. Uh, and I'll just bring her for a short walk, because I brought her for a really long walk yesterday. So, yeah, it's just, I thought I was gonna maybe go out and do something today, but I didn't feel like it, so. I'm wearing a reflective jacket, because I'm, you know, don't wanna get hit by a car, but. It is 5 p.m. Why is it so dark? You can't even tell how dark it is right now, but it's like nighttime. The TV is super loud. I'm just gonna turn it down. But I feel like I need to post something about like this on my stories. Obviously, I'm back from walking the dog. My mom's home. Uh, we're just cooking dinner. But I still get quite a few messages about my internship. So if you're new here, Around this time last year, I got an internship at the UN and I started in January and uh, at the Secretariat to the HQ in New York. And yeah, so I posted a couple of videos on that before. I'll link them in the cards. I have a playlist. I'll just link the playlist. And um, I still get a lot of questions about UN stuff. So like internship stuff. And I have done two Q&As on my channel. Um, I've done some day in the life. I've just I answer DMs probably at least once at least once a week um, but I don't I feel like I have admitted this before um, I have you know gotten a bit more strict on what I'm gonna answer and that is just because honestly if you're gonna be asking me such detailed questions and like paragraphs and paragraphs back and forth 
drop me a follow, okay? <laughs> Which sounds so terrible to say, but if you're not gonna subscribe or if you're not gonna like follow me on Instagram Don't get salty when I don't answer your questions. First of all, they get filtered into my like spam You know like outside of my regular uh, inbox because I won't I'm likely not following you and then They'll be like I get so many junk messages all the time. So I don't see them, you know you get like random guys sending the fire emoji and you know like real spammy stuff so all of that and then you know people are asking me really specific questions and sometimes I'm not comfortable answering them um and sometimes they're obviously sometimes if people googled it they could find out and other times it's just not something I'm in a place to or to do or to want to do so I feel like that's just so like bitchy of me but I feel like I would I am gonna admit that on this here sorry not sorry but yeah especially really specific questions like I often get people asking me and like this is not because of this one person it's something that I get all the time and it's just not something my dog can't even hear anything I don't know what she's barking at like sending me a direct message about really specific things like mostly so what I'm saying is mostly the ones that I find more difficult to answer is about budgeting and how much you need to save and stuff like that and that's just like how long is a piece of string kind of question like it's something I genuinely can't answer and I hate having to send back the same message to all these people being like I'm very sorry but I just can't answer that because that depends hugely on how you choose to live your life day to day like honestly it's so such a huge variation but yeah like getting a dm and then you know i'm currently trying to write like all these papers and then somebody commenting on a video being like hey uh can you answer my dm thanks just a bit much you know people just need to like settle down a small bit um so i i don't mind answering people's questions about like what my experience was like or stuff like that but like i feel like a lot of the stuff I get asked by people, oh, I'm going to be, you know, finish school soon, like secondary school. Could I, do you think I could do an internship at the UN before I graduate? Like before, no, or before I start college? And like, you should look into the application process first. I know that sounds so, I feel like such a bitch, but like, no, you have to have completed at least two years or is it at least three years? I think you have to have completed at least three years of a bachelor's degree. So you need to be like, as Americans would say, a senior, a final year, or like in my case, graduated, because my course was only three years. So stuff like that, you know, people wondering what departments to apply to, stuff like that. So um, as I said, those videos are linked in that playlist if that is something that you're interested in. You know, I have a box for questions, like a Q&A box in my story highlights, like for my, it's literally like UN internship questions. Um, but people just want to DM me because apparently they just want that attention, I guess. Um, but yeah, that can be a little bit frustrating. I'm like, really? Would it hurt you to just drop me a follow? But, uh, yeah. So that's, I just got a comment there and I was like, oh. and I kept meaning, I keep meaning to address it. And honestly, whenever it's happening most, I'm always like, like looking at my phone in bed or something. I don't want to post a story, but I've been talking for like three minutes so I think I'm also just gonna wrap up this episode of vlogmas if you're watching this I have just posted a life update get ready with me video which was pretty fun so I will link that here and I'll give you the shortcut to subscribe here be sure to subscribe because I will be hopefully posting a lot more frequently in December uh, my next vlogmas episode will be more interesting um because I'm going to the thing tomorrow and then this Thursday and then Friday, Saturday and Sunday I will be volunteering at an animal welfare centre. There's going to be puppies. So subscribe for puppies.